As I've told people before, why did wrestling work in my legal career? Because it's called a practice. I always say every year I want to be a better lawyer at the end than I was at the beginning. And that's what you as wrestlers always strive for. Those of you who've gotten from one point to another have always done that. You have sought to strive, to seek, to never yield. Eventually, as we know, we all at some point will yield to time, but not today. We all must yield to father time, but not today. We will yield to injuries, but not today. We can yield to doubt, but not today. We can yield to cynicism, but not today. We can yield to the fact that there is a crappy venue, but not today. Yeah. We can yield to the fact that it is cold out there, Amen. but not today. We can yield to the idea that this isn't the biggest pay they will ever get, but not today. What we will only yield to is that we are a part of that ring of friendship. We are a part of the squared circle magic. We are a part of the history that stretches all the way back from when Earl Jenks and Farmer Burns did this in an Iowa barn, all the way to the day where they do it at big giant stadiums at WrestleMania. We are a part of that. We will not yield. We will not yield. We will not yield. We will only strive. We will seek. And in the end, my friends, we will find that which binds us together. It is not just blood, it is not just emotion, it is that special spirit. And we are now going to let those people in the stands feel it with us for the next few hours. We're going to make sure that for everybody, those in the ring, those watching in attendance, those who hear about it on the internet, those who hear about it on podcasts, so they will all remember that this was your time! Yeah! Wrestling. Independent wrestling. <laughs>